Regional bank ETFs, are they expensive given the banking crisis? Regional banks, banks operate within a particular geographic region in contrast to national banks that have a presence across the entire country. Typical financial services include checking and savings accounts, loans, and credit cards. Some examples of regional banks include PNC, SunTrust, Regions Financial Corporation, BB&T Corporation, and Fifth Third Bank Corp. I'm not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. Regional banks operate in specific geographic areas and therefore are exposed to more risk that is predominant in those areas. Certain industries are more predominant in certain parts of the country. Regional banks also have less access to funding sources than national banks, so they are more vulnerable to liquidity and funding risks during crisis. There is the possibility that regional banks are not as well diversified as national banks given a more limited range of investment opportunities. As I look at the S, uh, the Spider S&P Regional Banking ETF, ticker KRE, I'm seeing a PE ratio of 7.87. The price is around $46 as of this video. Chase is trading at a PE of 10.89. Bank of America is trading at a PE of 9.07. Wells Fargo has a PE of 12.4. I don't believe there is enough of a discount on regional banks yet to justify the additional risk they carry. I very well may be wrong. Let's see what happens during the rest of March and April.